I feel really quite upset about that part of it because I've had my grandkids living here as well and I've had my family living here and I've still got my family living here and I don't want to harm them, you know. I mean, we thought we were safe. Bucks and Vamp didn't know anything about it. No, not at all. Not at all. There was a discussion in regards to where was the water coming from, where did it go from Buxton, did it come this way, did it go north, I think it went due north in a totally different direction. But actually it's coming this way, mm. it's coming and right the test, on to, to us. So they suddenly yeah. realised, that was, you know, some yeah. months later, they realised that the water is in fact going in different directions and there's a lot of people they didn't realise were taking the bore water. I don't like the bore water and so I don't drink it. We have the roof water here as well. But Neville loves the bore water. It's always been very nice, yeah. I wasn't the only person that liked it and other people liked the water, it was great. But then was it bad way back then, 10 years ago? Or was it more recent? I don't know. We got a test back at that stage at about 11, 11.9 11 I, I think it was, was which was really yeah. high. I still had no idea what that meant. When I found out just the big dangers is when we went to one of the big community meetings after COVID and um, they start talking about some of the concerns of the nitrate and there's the possibilities in the health that it actually could be part of a leading to cancer and things like that as well. And at that stage, I was in shock in the meeting and um, Neville, two years ago, was diagnosed with brain tumour um, cancer, which is terminal. And I was upset because he's always been incredibly healthy, incredibly, he's been your triathlons, your half Ironmans, bikes 26 k's to work each day and back. And we're always wondering why. I mean, we don't know. I mean, and, and we're not even going to try and prove it. But just the the thought that that could be part of the reason why Neville's sick, um, it really upset me. No, I'm not sick. My brain doesn't turn probably. <laughs> I think they need to reduce it or look at some other way of doing it so that that, I mean the, the idea would be is, is not to have that issue of it coming up to 11.3. That's too high. They, they need to be reducing it. Like we are with everything else, we need to be aiming to get lower, you know, and, and to bring things more comfortable and, and, and healthy and safe. Yeah, 11.3 still not, that's, that's not, not good. there must be some other way. There are questions that mm. have been, I've raised, others have raised, I, they don't have the answers yet. I hope that they do find answers, which is good for them, good for the farmers, and then good for those people that receive the, the underground water. That's the idea.